let's face it, packaging sells. You want a SaaS product that looks appealing, modern, professional and thoughtfully designed. You probably know that many high-end perfume brands actually design the box first, then the bottle. And then finally, once the designs have been tested and validated, they create the actual perfume. And it's because they understand that the packaging of a product is crucial for its success. Steve Jobs and Apple understood this when it came to hardware, way before most of the competitors. With software and SaaS, the equivalent of this is the UI, the look and feel of your product. If you want to make your product more sellable, you should make the UI and design of your app one of the highest priorities from the very beginning. This shouldn't be an afterthought. And one of the easiest ways to get this premium grade look and feel is to use UI kits created by professional designers. My products, FeedHive, 8Base, TinyKiwi, and LinkDrip, all get a lot of praise for their sleek designs and professional UI UX. And yes, we do have a professional UI engineer on my team, but the truth is, we're not creating everything from scratch. Far from it. In fact, we're heavy users of pre-made UI kits. And in this video, I'll share some of my favorite picks. Let's kick things off with Untitled UI, a comprehensive and beautiful looking UI kit that's designed specifically for building high fidelity prototypes and polished final products. This tool comes packed with over 3,000 components and hundreds of pre-designed templates that make it super easy to build an amazing interface. It's built for Figma and it can be as advanced as you prefer. I'm no Figma expert by any means, but I've still managed to build some really nice looking UIs using this kit. And the UI designer on my team loves it because she can go nuts with auto layout, variables, smart variants, accessibility features, and all those things that make it a pleasure to work with for professional UI engineers. And now Figma has dev mode and they have a VS Code extension too. We're also using Cursor to help with web development and simply giving the Cursor agent a reference image of the designs actually works really, really well. It's all making it a really smooth process to build amazing premium grade products. Untitled UI has both a free and a paid version. The paid version is a little expensive compared to other UI kits, but honestly, it's totally worth the money. Next one on the list is Shadzian. This is arguably one of the hottest UI kits we currently have available. It's not only a design system like Untitled UI. Shadzian provides you with reusable, accessible React components that you can copy and paste directly into your code base. You can think of it as a curated set of high quality building blocks. The cool thing about Shadzian is how easily customizable it is. All of the components are already really well designed, but if you want to tweak them, it's very easy to adjust them using Tailwind CSS. This will give you full control, but will help your app keep a unique and consistent design. If you have a UI UX engineer on your team, Shadzian also has official Figma files for all of their components. You can use these Figma files to customize and refine the look and feel, then apply the themes to the component system itself with pretty minimal effort. And also here, you get the benefit of a very AI-friendly component system. OpenAI and Claude know their way around both Shadzian and Tailwind, so it's very easy to give it instructions and have Cursor carry out an almost flawless implementation. Next, let's take a look at base design system from Uber. This is a small toolkit designed for building web interfaces that require a sophisticated and modern aesthetic. It offers a full suite of components that are tailored for creating interfaces with focus on urban and modern design elements. This toolkit is intended to help teams build web applications rapidly while maintaining consistency with Uber's design language. Uber's style guide is rather minimalistic. It supports what they call a user-centric design philosophy, which means it's focusing on clarity, efficiency, and accessibility. It's not exactly as comprehensive as some of the other UI kits, but it's free. It's very easy to use and, in my opinion, quite nice looking. Though one downside is that the Uber design is fairly recognizable. So if you don't want people to get Uber associations when using your app, perhaps this UI kit is not the way to go. An alternative to this design kit is Bootstrap 5 UI kit, which reminds a bit of Uber base, but has a little bit less distinct Uber look and feel to it. Next on the list, we have another UI component kit for React called SaaS UI. 
This is one of those hidden gems that deserves much more attention. SAS UI is created for Next.js and React apps and it's built on top of Chakra UI, one of the most popular component systems for React. Just like Shadzian, SAS UI offers an extensive collection of pre-built components. These include everything from simple UI elements like buttons and forms to more complex components like data tables and charts. This library is designed to help you build intuitive and visually appealing user interfaces. And in addition to the component library, SAS UI offers a variety of starter kits as well. These kits come pre-configured with essential features like authentication, navigation, billing, and much more. They are designed to help you get up and running quickly and reduce the time you spend on setting up so you can focus on building your product. My team and I are actually using SAS UI for one of our products. As you can see on their website, we got 8Base right there. As well as a testimonial from me a little further down. And I truly mean it when I say that this component library has been a massive help. It's obvious that an incredible amount of work has gone into this and despite it being relatively new, it's still very robust and well tested. One downside of course is that while SAS UI does provide a whole lot of flexibility and power, it might be more than what you need if you're simply looking for a design system for your app. All in all though, really love this product. I highly recommend checking it out. Another UI component library and design system I rarely hear anyone mention is Reshaped. And it's a shame because it's such a nice looking design system. With Reshaped, you get access to a component library for React, a Figma file with the full design system. And if you want to create your own custom design system from scratch, Reshaped actually provides you with a ton of handy utilities that will save you a ton of time. It's a simple but beautiful looking UI kit that definitely deserves more attention. They have a basic free tier and a very affordable full version at a one-time cost. If you want the full source code version, it's a bit more expensive, but for most use cases, the design license will do perfectly fine. Finally, I recently stumbled on this brand new UI kit specifically for AI chat interfaces. It's called Assistant UI. It's built on top of ChatCN and contains ready-made components specifically designed to build a chat-like interface like ChatGPT, Gemini, Claude, DeepSeek, and so on. It's very small and simple and it has this one specific purpose. But let's face it, a whole lot of products are now building some sort of chat interfaces into their SaaS and this does look really nice. Don't make the mistake of thinking that your prototype or MVP isn't supposed to look nice. It is. Users just won't settle with crap looking apps anymore and trust me, even if your solution is still scrappy in the beginning, it adds a ton to the perceived value of your product if you prioritize making it feel and look nice from the very beginning. And with these UI kits, you can do that at almost no extra time and cost. Now, to get your SaaS off ground, you also need to cover operations, marketing and growth. And in this video, I'll go through the most economic version of this entire setup for you. I will see you over there.